Welcome to Night Prayer. We gather again with the one who knows us, who cares for us, who delights in us, who is with us every moment of the day and who invites us to recognise his presence with him too. So we take a moment, reflecting and coming again to the one who welcomes us and delights in us. John 6 verse 40, Jesus said, All who see the Son and believe in him may have eternal life, and I will raise them up on the last day. The Lord Almighty grant us a quiet night and a perfect end. Our help is in the name of the Lord who made heaven and earth. So we pause and reflect on this day and all that is past. Save us, O Lord, while waking, and guard us while sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep may rest in peace. From Psalm 22, verse 30. Posterity will serve him. Future generations will be told about the Lord. Posterity will serve him. When we wonder about what's going on in the church, about how people will tell of his name. Those times when we look and think, Lord, what is going on? They expected and wondered in generations past who would be those who would tell. And the David, the psalmist, says posterity will serve him. Future generations will tell of God. They will be told about him. They will be see, they will see and know. We can hold on to the truth that God is not going away, that he will continue to make himself known. We play our part. We tell others that they may tell others. We keep on knowing that nothing can destroy or stop God's word going out. Let's pray. Loving God, thank you for the ways in which you have spoken your word to us, for those who've revealed truth to us. Thank you for those who we have spoken to you about you, for those who have been impacted by our, by our lives, known and unknown. And we pray, may those seeds grow, may they bear fruit, may your lives be changed as people come to know you in this generation and the generations to come. Amen. Visit this place, O Lord, we pray, and drive far from it the snares of the enemy. May your holy angels dwell with us in peace. And may your blessing be always upon us, through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. And we pray together. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as in heaven. Give us today our daily bread. Forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. Lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power and the glory are yours, now and forever. Amen. In peace we will lie down and sleep. For you alone, Lord, make us dwell in safety. Now may God be in the going out, going in and coming, going out and coming in of his people. 
May God be in your foundations. May God be in every movement throughout this world. Amen. Bless you and sleep well.